Creative Reviews, baby. It is finally here. Real, raw, and uncut. The launch titles to the Xbox Series X. All the games I'm about to tell you, just yummy, 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 yummy. But some of y'all and me is going to be disappointed because half of these lists are old ass games but it's telling you that it has smart deliveries which can upgrade to an xbox series x you know what i'm saying personifications to the you know next gen games we got assassin's creed bahala we got borderlands 3 we got cuisine royale we got bright memory we got dead by daylight we also got evergate we got fortnite once again yes nwa 2k21 Man, what about a boxing game, fight night or something? We got Enlisted, got Gears 5, Gears Tactic. We also got the Falconeer, King's Eye Oddball, Overseer System Redux. Once again, Sea of Thieves, hoorah! We got Forza Horizon, already been released, week. <sighs> Ori in the Wheel in the Wasp, Planet Roller Coaster, Tetris Effect, Devil May Cry Special Edition, and Dirt 5, The Taurus, Warhammer, Chaos Born, I already have it. War Thunder, pow, 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 pow. we got Yakuza like a dragon. With that being said, my real raw crew, so we are getting a lot, a lot of old games that's already been released on the Xbox One into the next gen. And it's pretty, pretty sad that Microsoft is going out the, you know, lazy route with this. I don't see no just core Xbox Series X only game title that's only compatible with this system that we can all enjoy. We just get to enjoy the, you know, upgradable fan service. You know what I'm saying? That's going to upgrade all these old games into, you know, the modern new gen system. Now, do you guys see me pointing at the subscribe button right there? Make sure you subscribe and hit the bell for the notifications for me to do more videos for you guys. Love you all, Real Raw Crew.